Okay, welcome. Um, so you're probably watching this video because you cannot access the new matter uh, store or you just want to use your mod T offline and uh, one of the alternative methods uh, recommended by newmatter.com here in the support section is using astroprint to send the G code to your mod T. So this guide that I'm looking at here is uh, fairly detailed and this video is just a visual representation of the same exact information. Okay, so let's get started. So first step would be go to astroprint.com and sign up for an account if you do not already have one. It's completely free of charge. Uh, just hit sign up and once your account is ready, we are going to log in. For this purpose, I'm gonna use my demo account. And once I'm logged in, the first step I wanna do is go to the printer profile section in the dashboard on the top, uh, sorry, bottom left. And we are going to click on new printer profile. And for the manufacturer, we're gonna select new matter followed by mod T. We're gonna hit add to my printers. And on the very bottom, actually I have another copy I'm gonna get rid of. Okay, so this is what we just added and all the printer settings have been preloaded. You don't have to worry about any of this. And we're gonna click on the Astroprint logo to go back to the dashboard. So the next step is going to be, we're going to upload your SDL file to Astroprint to generate the G code. So we'll click on design uploader on the uh, top left, select the SDL, open it. Okay, it's done. All right, so this is the print screen and on the right hand, so on, on the left you'll see a, a rendering of your design. On the right hand side you'll see choose your printer. So from here we're going to select mod T and for choose your material we gotta click on add material. We'll create a custom material. We'll put in PLA and for the film and diameter we'll put 1.75. Temperature is gonna be 220. We're gonna save it. We're gonna keep it in normal uh, print quality for now. Now it's actually ready to, uh, ready to slice. Your design is ready to slice but if you are an advanced user you could go to the advanced slice settings and you can mess around with uh, skirt, brim, infill, or tweak any advanced settings you'd like. And uh, once, you, once you're done with that, if you're gonna do all the advanced stuff, you could hit slice right here. Uh, if not, this is, this is all you need. Basically, you're gonna slice, and the cloud slicer is gonna take care of everything. And we're gonna end up in a screen where you'll see the finished file. So this down arrow will actually download the resulting G code. So I'm going to, uh, let's see, I'm, I'm going to rename it uh, ready to print G code for the mod T. Okay. And we're going to save it. And that's it. So that that G code is what we're going to use to print. Unfortunately, I'm not going to show you the other, uh, the second half of the guide, which requires the mod T printer utility. So you would basically use the um, Marty printer utility, go to settings, go to advanced mode, select print file, and in step five, you would select the G code file you just downloaded from Astroprint. And uh, that's it. I hope you found this video useful. Uh, if you have any questions, uh, feel free to let us know. Thank you.